Good evening, everybody, and welcome once again to the study of the vicarage of the parish of All Saints in Harrow Weald. I'm Father John Barker, and while our church doors are sadly still closed, uh, we continue with our worship with daily live stream services. This evening, we will have the beautiful service of night prayer uh, from the Book of Common Prayer. It'll start around six o'clock, and as we prepare for worship, we will listen to the Teze rendition, Bless the Lord My Soul. Thank you. 
I pray on behalf of us all. Bless the Lord, my soul. Night prayer, also known as Compline, from the Book of Common Prayer. I greet you all in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about, seeking whom he may desire, whom resist, steadfast in the faith. But thou, O Lord, have mercy upon us. Thanks be to God. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who hath made heaven and earth. Let's keep silent for a moment as we give thanks for all of God's gifts of this day. And now let us confess to Almighty God our imperfections. And as the day draws to a close, ask him to comfort us in his arms. We pray together. We confess to God Almighty, the Father, the Son and the Holy Ghost, that we have sinned in thought, word and deed through our own grievous fault. Wherefore, we pray God to have mercy upon us. Almighty God, have mercy upon us. Forgive us all our sins and deliver us from all evil. Confirm and strengthen us in all goodness and bring us to life everlasting through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. May the almighty and merciful Lord grant unto you pardon and remission of all your sins, time for amendment of life, and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Praise ye the Lord. The Lord's name be praised. Our night hymn. The beautiful night hymn before the ending of the day.
Our evening psalm, Psalm 134. Behold now, praise the Lord, all ye servants of the Lord, ye that by night stand in the house of the Lord, even in the courts of the house of our God. Lift up your hands in the sanctuary and praise the Lord. The Lord that made heaven and earth give thee blessing out of Zion. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Our verses of scripture this evening are from the book of Hebrews. Now the God of peace that brought again from the dead our Lord Jesus, that great shepherd of the sheep, through the blood of the everlasting covenant, make you perfect in every good work to do his will, working in you that which is well-pleasing in his sight. Through Jesus Christ, to whom be glory for ever and ever. Amen. Into thy hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. Into thy hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. For thou hast redeemed me, O Lord, thou God of truth. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost. Into thy hands, O Lord, <coughs> I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. Keep me as the apple of an eye. Hide me under the shadow of thy wings. Our Gospel Canticle, the Nunc Dimittis. Preserve us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, now let us, thou, thy servant, depart in peace according to thy word for mine eyes have seen thy salvation which thou hast prepared before the face of all people to be a light to lighten the gentiles and to be the glory of thy people israel glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy ghost as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Preserve us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Our evening prayers. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive them that trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Blessed art thou, Lord God of our fathers, to be praised and glorified above all for ever. Let us bless the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Let us praise him and magnify him forever. Blessed art thou, O Lord, in the firmament of heaven, 
to be praised and glorified above all forever. The Almighty and most merciful Lord, guard us and give us his blessing. Let us pray. Dear Lord, in the evening of the day, we come to you in prayer and thanksgiving. We thank you for all of your gifts of this day, for all that we have been able to do and enjoy, for the breaths of air that we have breathed, for the joyous sights that we have seen, for the food that we have eaten, the clothes that we wear, the joys of nature all around us, our homes in which we live. These are just some of your gifts to us. We thank you for them all. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And now we pray for the world in which we live, your world. Forgive us, Lord, that we, as your children, make judgments regarding some people, some things, as inferior, some as inferior. Lord, help us to understand that in your eyes we are all equal. We are all loved by you. May we love each other as you love us. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lord, now we pray for those who are directly affected by coronavirus. We pray for those who are still sick and for those who are caring for them. We pray for those who are earnestly trying to find vaccines and antibodies and systems so that we might be safer in our daily lives. We pray for the leaders of our countries. May they be dedicated in seeking to find better ways that we can live that are fair for all. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And now we pray for those who have a, a special need for your comfort and your strength at this time. We hold in our hearts those who we know and love personally, who particularly need your support at this time. From our parish list, we continue to pray for Jane Slade, for Angela Kidd, for Claire Rawdy, and for Laura Baker. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Finally in these prayers we ask for your mercy and commend to your blessing the immortal souls of those who have died in these last hours. And from our congregation and parish we commend to you the immortal souls of Hilary Diamond, Marie Despra. Rita Todd, Carla Swift and Elsie Nicholson. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lighten our darkness, we beseech thee, O Lord, and by thy great mercy defend us from all perils and dangers of this night for the love of thy only Son, our Saviour, Jesus Christ. 
we will lay us down in peace and take our rest. For it is thou, Lord, only that makest us dwell in safety. Abide with us, O Lord, for it is toward evening and the day is far spent. As the watchmen look for the morning, so do we look for thee, O Christ. The Lord be with you and with thy spirit. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Almighty and Merciful Lord, the Father, the Son and the Holy Ghost, bless us and preserve us this evening and always. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Amen. Thank you for joining us for night prayer this evening. I wish you a peaceful happy and safe rest of this evening. I pray that your sleep may be restful and that the coming morning may dawn with all sorts of opportunities for you. We will have live worship again tomorrow, starting at 10.30. It'll be Eucharist with hymns. But for now, I leave you with the beautiful rutter rendition the lord bless you and keep you